What is up, everyone? This is my second time filming this. Um, I think I smoked about half my pipe. Yeah, about half. Yeah, I was recording for five minutes, and uh, one thing I hate about new iPhones that I'm glad was not on the old iPhones is even when you delete something, like a picture, a video, it puts it in a deleted file. It doesn't just clear it off the phone. No, you got to delete it. Then you got to go to your deleted photos and delete it again. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I didn't do that. I think I had both the Red the both the Red Bull reviews. The one I just did this morning and the one I did a few days ago. And I think I had two Wake and Bakes on there. Which, I don't even think my phone, I don't know. That really makes me think, like, how much space do I actually have on this bitch? Like, when I clear the videos, I'm not using them. Cheers. Because I know for a fact I can clear a lot of, a lot of apps. I almost joked on that it, but I know I could clear a lot of apps out, and probably be able to record for like an hour or so, but I feel like that's a little bit overkill. Let me know if that's overkill. Because <coughs> <coughs> if it's not, bro, I'm pretty sure it is. I'm pretty sure it is. Yeah, I did do the Peach Review Red Bull. If y'all want to go check that out, I recommend checking out. I'm not going to... I'm not going to drop nothing on you guys. I'm not going to tell you guys how it tastes. Nah, you got to watch the review. I'm not even going to make a face like it's good or it's bad. I'm just going to sit here drinking it like it's water. And that's how you sell a review. I did want to talk about music because I got three unreleased songs right now. My original plan was to compile about four to ten songs, short songs, short unreleased songs. And the more I thought about, the more I was just like, well, eh. Because I don't want to keep people waiting for, like, a super long time. But I also don't want to just put out, like, a lot of short songs. Regardless, a lot of my songs are short. But, like, the three songs I got right now, I think they're all under a minute thirty. All three of them are under a minute 30. So, I don't know. I don't know. I even thought about, like, maybe compiling all the three songs I already have done. And just, like, making a mashup. But it's just like, bro, what would... What's the meaning of that? For one. Two, what would I call that? Three, would it be a song or would it be a mashup of three individual songs? And that that comes back to the question. If it's a mashup of three different songs, wouldn't, I, wouldn't people want me to drop the songs individually? Maybe I'm thinking about it too hard. And I thought about that last night. I was like, bro, maybe I'm thinking about this way too hard. And I just need to drop a song. You know, maybe that would make me feel a little bit better. Just drop a song. And then, 
you know, wait a little bit, maybe drop another song. And then the songs that I don't really think are up to par with what I want to release, just drop them, like, on Bandcamp, you know? I don't know. I don't know. Cheers. So, uh, yeah, let me know, let me know. I know every time I ask for you to let me know something, normally people don't let me know anything, which is kind of annoying, but, yeah, I don't know. Another thing. I've been wanting to use this vape so bad, and I, I still can use it, by the way. Or can I? <coughs> I can't. I almost threw up. The point I was trying to get at. Oh god, I still taste the fucking cotton, bro. Or the fucking coil, or whatever the fuck that is, bro. And it. The point I was trying to get at. Is, bro, I've been thinking about getting another vape. Or something. Or. Seeing if they have pods. Because I've just been buying cigarettes. I haven't went up there exclusively looked for pods but I was thinking about maybe getting a jewel but the problem I have with jewel is the pods already come pre-filled that sucks another thing for four pods it's $16 if if I if I am correct uh. oh my god that's nasty I think I was drinking one night, and I was just hitting it, hitting it, hitting it, and I was pretty drunk, and I think the flavor just flew over my head, no pun intended, but I have been hitting this, even though they tell you not to put um, Nick Salt in sub-ohms, I got it at a pretty low 40 watts, and it works. The only thing is the 40 watts I don't really get. Like a full, full cloudy less like I just it's like really slowly and lightly. But it burns the back of my fucking throat more than that does. Way more. Way, 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 way more. Ugh. And that's why they tell you, do not. Or, what does it say? Not intended for sub -ohms. Not for sub ohm use. Not for sub ohm atomizers. I can't even read this morning. And or devices only for low wattage, mouth to lung devices. And that's probably where I'm fucking up. Because unless you have like a little, little sub ohm, like, that shit usually just goes right. Add to your throat like a mom pit because you gotta. I don't know. The last hit. 
actually left a little fucking tear in my eye. That really burned. Anyways, cheers. Off topic, I've been having like a twitch in this eye. I don't know if anyone's noticed it. Or notice like maybe this eye is more open than that eye. But for some reason I can fully control this eye. But this eye will twitch sometimes. Sometimes it'll just be really shut. Sometimes it'll just be really open. I don't know what's wrong with my eye. But for about a year now. I haven't really talked about it. But like. Yeah, it's been happening about a year now. And it kind of sucks, because sometimes I'll just be sitting there watching something, then my eye will just fucking fidget. And it's fucking annoying. And makes me just want to go like that and just fucking put an eye patch over my eye or fucking hold my eye closed. I don't know. I don't know why that was worth mentioning. Probably just because I never mentioned it before. And for some reason, I'm really noticing it in this episode. Maybe it's just because I'm turning my head like that. And like that a lot. Does it look off to y'all guys? Because it looks fucking off to me. Y'all think, hey, Fred, you're doing that on purpose. And I'm not. Now I am. Trying to. I can control it a little bit. But like, control them together, that's a little bit hard. Oh, that looks creepy. I don't know what the fuck I'm doing, bro. <sighs> Cheers. my bowl's almost out. That means it lasted me over 15 minutes. Including the other sesh that I had to delete to make room for this sesh. If YouTube still had the feature, or if YouTube still had YouTube Studios, I forget what it was called. YouTube Editor? I forget what it was called, but it was an app where you could literally slice videos together. If YouTube still had that app where it worked, I would not have to delete the first half. Could just leave the other shit and just fucking slice it together. Like, oh, my, my camera cut off. Goddamn. I would use some editing shit on my computer because I think I have like one or two different editing programs but they're both free so I would have a big ass logo and I don't want a big ass logo one has a big ass logo that pops up across the whole screen for like a minute and then goes away and then the other one has like their logo just plastered I think it's either right there or right there. I don't know, bro. I'm getting some money for my uh, tax return. And <clears throat> I'm still trying to get the money paid off and get it down a little bit but I do want to have like a little money for myself from the tax return I'm not gonna say how much it is but I will have enough to pay a lot of money and still have a few a few hundred and 
I really, 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 really want to start making beats. And the place that I used to make beats, or usually made beats, was Fruity Loops. And I don't know what it is. It's probably because when I was in San Antonio, I actually had access to use fucking, uh, what's it called? GarageBand? GarageBand is so, so, so much fucking easier. You can make so much of a better sounding song on GarageBand. And... I don't know what I'm going to do because my computer is shit. I need to replace my computer. But I'm not going to have that much money to buy any Apple product that would have GarageBand. So I really... It puts me in a spot where I don't know what to do. Because this computer runs slow. This computer crashes a lot. That's why I don't want to put GarageBand on like a shit computer because I could pay like so much and I'm pretty sure I could download it on a Windows product but man I wish I had like enough money to get like a little like notebook then down garage download GarageBand like a, li a literal like little notebook computer that I could just like set on my arm and just fucking work on like that bro that's what I always wanted I don't even think they make macbooks that small bro but I know uh those chromebooks are pretty freaking small bro and they're light cheers I was gonna get a Nintendo Switch and then the more I think about it the more I pull myself off the ideal of getting a Nintendo Switch because I'm just like well I don't really play video games that much I don't really have time to play video games and not only that every time I do play a video game it usually lasts for maybe an hour or two maybe three hours sometimes all night you know 